Hello and welcome to Ham's Pokemon and today I have this black and white era Keldeo box. Um, this has got a fantastic figure it says. <laughs> Three black and white series booster packs and two special foil Keldeo promotional cards. One of them is oversized so who doesn't want an oversized card? <laughs> So I'll go ahead and get it opened up. And I've talked recently about a lot of the older products that I've bought and, and whether or not they're um, repackaged or not, or not. It, you know, one thing that you you do have to be aware of um, when buying these older products is that that they can be they can be remade quite easily. Like this one here, for instance. As long as someone just put the plastic on, is able to put the plastic on the outside like that then it's really easy for them to repackage these. So here is the oversized card, and it is a Keldeo EX from Boundaries Crossed. And actually they did have a theme deck that was based around this. Uh, one of the championship winning decks played this card. So it was, a, I believe it was a very playable card. Very cool card. Let's go ahead and get the plastic out of the way. Here is the figure. Whether I can get it into the right position or not is another question altogether there we go fairly easy actually actually a really cool figure this is the first one i have with these where you you sit them on the base like that so i'll pop that to the side looks like two dragons exalted packs yep and a noble victories booster pack to go with the promotional card of Keldeo. So a really cool Keldeo card I don't own. Um, always happy to have new cards. With those really cool like lines running across. I can't remember what they exactly called those and it's black and white 60. Cool promo. So that will go at the back. So two Dragons Exalted booster packs and a Noble Victory. So I'll go ahead and open the Noble Victories first. So yeah, so I was just talking about uh, talking to a couple of people the other day about uh, about resealed booster packs. Uh, go ahead and enjoy this code for Noble Victories, and you just you just don't know. You are taking like a bit of a punt on them. A couple of these boxes I've had quite good luck with. The, all, pretty much all the single packs I've ever bought um, have. N I don't think any of them have ever had a hit in them, and that that could be down to luck but that also is quite likely to be the fact that they were weighed unfortunately because it's easy to weigh the old packs um i'd like to think people are honest but they don't to be fair they never say that they haven't weighed them so it's kind of hard to know so the reverse is as well as and the rare is just a reuniclus a reuniclus um not a particular pokemon that i'm a massive fan of but um i don't even know if i own that card i'm not sure um Ah, oh, this one first. So two packs here of Dragons Exalted, a, a pretty cool set actually. I do really like this set. Um, some nice artwork in it. I do just, I don't mind doing the Patrick for the black and white era, as it's an era that isn't too old. You know, this is 2012, so we're talking six years old now. That's fairly old for uh, for Pokemon, but not terribly old. Dino, Phoebus under a big bridge. Reverse is a skip plume and the rare is just a dust ox so not doing too well in these either unfortunately but you know sometimes that can be the game too so even though I could think that it was repackaged it could just easily be just terrible luck. Um, it's hard to really ever say. So on to the final pack and it is a Cascoon Skip Loom, which I just got in reverse. Special Energy, which um, is very similar to the ones that we're seeing now in Ultra Prism. Drift Bloom, Murkrow, Yanmar, a Trubbish. <laughs> Drift Loom, reverse is a Drift Loom. So the, none of the reverse is particularly fantastic, and the rare is. Unfortunately, it is a Marowak. So, there's potential that this, I'm not saying that it was, but um, three packs with nothing in them at all, it's possible that that was also um, 
potentially repackage it. I did have an actual issue where I bought a tin and it, it I think I spoke about this in an early video where it, it was repackaged. It had the wrong packs in it. So, um, but, uh, I don't know, it's nice just to open the old cards. It's nice just to have those old cards there, but um, a really poor showing in terms of pulls. So I do wonder a little bit. So thanks a lot guys for popping on by. Please like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, goodbye.